1.4 another update has been rolled out for redmi 7 and redmi y3 and this is the control center of project place and you people already know if you are using that room for a long time then of course and this is android 12 f but the control center is not like android 12 this really cool because some people still don't like the uh, control center of android 12 this is a great change here and which looks really cool and you guys will get the uh, pop-up animation when just uh, tap on the switch button so power up button whatever you say an advanced feature and directly this can uh, uh, go to your settings so let's get started so this is the setting user interface uh, on the top you guys will get your username and IDs then we have the network and internet and other things so before we start I just want to show you the about section and which is really cool and about uh, section has been redef redesigned and build number and the most important changes in that version we have in kernel which is latest source has been uh, uh, made here and added which is uh, since pop kernel you guys already know and version is updated to 1.1 android 12 l and blaze version 1.4 and device maintainer really thanks to them android security update which is july 5 that means uh, the last from last month and kernel version you guys can see here and Linux status uh, that's it and this is the user interface of about section then we have the system and i'm using here the vanilla build of course i always recommend you guys to use the vanilla build and we have here the languages and input and if you want to change languages just go to languages and add languages and which you want just select according to your region that's it then we have the on screen keyboard physical keyboard and you guys can do the changes here is spell checker and personal dictionary and pointer speed whatever then we have the gesture as usual we have the gesture customization system navigation and navigation peel two button navigation three button just go to setting and then you guys can change the peel length like me and if you don't want the ime button space that means if you don't want the uh, a bottom space of your keyboard then turn off that feature then if you want to use full screen gesture that means if you don't want that navigation peel button then of course enable that one it will be removed and you guys already know about that and swipe to screenshot of course and double tap and everything is working fine without any issue and I don't want to waste time here by showing the regular things just the changes and accessibility password and accounts and everything is uh, just awesome here and battery backup is cool no issues then we have the security as usual we have all the customization like face unlock fingerprint and app lock of course everything is just working fine then notification section you guys can do app notification settings according to your choice which app you want to notification just turn on and which you don't want just turn that off then we have the notification history and if you want bubbles then just enable that feature and then conversations and sensitive notifications we have actually every single customization or notification and then we have apps and sounds as usual the regular customization here of every and we have the smart pause which is uh, 30 second no time out and one minute and which is customizable and then we have other things uh, like media vibration and touch vibration other things uh, per app volume control which is a really cool feature you guys can manually control uh, per app volume then we have the wallpaper and style as usual then we have dark theme the theme icons and regular things and my photos you guys can select from here and by default we will get that only one wallpaper which is by default wallpaper then we have the blaze house that means the customization hub I am using the custom font from here this kind of collection is there I am using here the uh, uh, monster whatever you say and not a serif and one plus sans one plus plate and pixel font huge kind of collections and icon packs other things the signal icons for Wi-Fi Wi-Fi icon shapes and other things everything is uh, present here no problem a status bar items and traffic indicator i already showed and it's working fine here on the top you guys can see then we have cloak and red customization battery styles uh, battery styles can be changed you know which i am already using on the top and which we, we have that uh, few collections 
then double tap to sleep and wake and use all this style mobile data then we have the volte and select volte icon according to your choice we have some collection here and then we have the web icon style os icon and motorola asus and emui whatever then camera and location is and like as before don't want to waste time here and brightness slider and qs transparency can be changed and make hits up and less annoying reticker which is cool thing i like use app color background you can select and here is the ticker uh, status bar ticker notification ticker or notification and music ticker uh, it's according to your choice you guys can just uh, set the value or uh, from default value you guys can change then we have the lock screen double tap to sleep and ripple effect and other things which is actually working fine and if you want to disable wallpaper zoom when you just opening app and closing if you don't want then turn that off and if you want the wallpaper uh, zoom then of course enable that feature and other things here we have the weather style setup weather option if you need then of course can be enabled from setting and you need celsius whatever you need and just turn on the location and th and the lastly we have here the vibrate on connect and other things and just when you make phone call um, the uh, if when you make a phone call and if the receiver receive the call you will just uh, get a vibration on connect then awaken plug and toast app icon other things toggle torch when screen off you guys can do that of course and this is the user interface and network settings we have the carrier uh, calling other video calling other things and this is the home screen of course uh, again let me show you the control center we have all the necessary customization here and no not a single bit lag you guys can see on the notification center control center whatever you say and this is the user interface and we have the settings here and miscellaneous use taskbar if you want to use and hidden and protected apps if you want to hide an application of course you can do that and i'm using, using here the icon packs from uh, play store i downloaded if you need to change your icon pack just click on pass icon and go to play store and download any icon pack you like then we have notification turn dots and icon size font size max lines uh, for app level and home screen customization lock layout and double tap to sleep and app icons everything is then show app lab icon levels on desktop and other things and app drawer that's it which is really cool feature for us and app opening and closing thing is just awesome the smoothness if people can see it's just in front of you which is really cool and faster really great app opening and closing just awesome no issues with that and this is the smoothness uh, of course if you use that room then of course you know how is that and if you want to use on your daily life you guys can do that and safety net passed by default no issues i already rooted my device with magix manager then of course we have the geekbench score and the geekbench score you will get uh, much better in that one uh, because of the latest updated kernel and i checked it on uh, different situation it will be different for different times and different uh, battery percentage and which is really great and CP throttling also also be great no problem with that and this is the gallery application by default you people will get and of course I'm using here vanilla build and the play store I installed personally and I'll drop the GUFs link in description always try to use that one so hope you guys understand the video if you like the work then do subscribe and hit the bell icon so thank you for watching